Borneo. Borneo is the third largest island in the world and it is located southeast of the Malaysian Peninsula. The tiny Sultanate of Brunei lies on the northwest coast and the largest part of the island, Kalimantan, belongs to Indonesia. The Malaysian provinces of Sarawak and Sabah cover roughly a quarter of the island. Malaysian Borneo is home to various Dayak or indigenous tribes. The most famous perhaps is the Ivan Headhunters. There is also a large number of Malay and Chinese people that call Borneo home. The Sarawak Cultural Village, just outside of Kuching, is a fantastic starting point if you're interested in learning about the various local cultures. Also called the Living Museum, there are over 150 people of different tribal backgrounds living here on the 7 hectare ground. They open their homes on a daily basis for visitors to come and observe their customs and routines. There is also a state-of-the-art theatre where you can see the locals perform their traditional dances every day.
Kuching itself is a great city with lots of things to explore. Most tourist attractions, restaurants and hotels are located on and around the waterfront. A sunset boat ride to the nearby night market is a must when visiting Kuching town. The Sarawak Cultural Village is also home to the annual Rainforest World Music Festival. Every year musicians from all over the world travel to Kuching to perform on the outdoor stages of the festival. South African musical legend Dizu Plaikis and the Ibuyambu Ensemble performed here and we caught them after a war dancing workshop where they annihilated the Australians. <laughs> Hello South Africa, my name is Ndombe Tongo Ngawa Tutsu in Port St. John's in the Eastern Cape. I'm here in Malaysia with Jesus Band. We're all coming from Cape Town and it's lovely here. It's hot like hell. Hi everybody at home. This is Wendy. Borneo, Malaysia. And it's nice to be here. It's good to be here. We just had a wonderful workshop, a world dancing with the Australian guys. Uh, Rainforest World Music Festival, it's amazing. Like everybody's so amazing here. Hello mom, hello dad. I love you all. <laughs> Great job today. Thank you. Hello, hello. My name is Dizu Plakis from South Africa, Cape Town. We are here to perform. You know what? We are from Mandela country. We are very proud. It's an honor to see Thank you guys you. live here. No problem. Thank you, Amazing. sister. Thank you. And we are breaking free now wherever we go. Muka is home to the annual Cow Festival. Kao is a cleansing and thanksgiving festival in which the Melanao people of the region appease the spirits of the sea, river and forest by offering them food and drinks. This would ensure a bountiful year of food for the tribe. The Pesta Kao or Kao festival is very much a celebration of the Melanao culture during which everybody in the region enjoy the local food, games and customs of the Melanao people. Ons supermarkt het nou so pas gearriveer en hierdie gedeelte is het betek keer moeilik om by die winkel uit te kom. So daar is een boot wat voorbij kom wat soos een supermarkt is. Um, en hy het spesifieke stoptuie wat hy sy rondes maak. So mense weet, jy weet die supermarkt is 11 uur in hierdie omgeving of 5 uur in die omgeving. Hier met die mens maar jou hoenerkies op hok hou, denk ek. Hier is baie wille katte. Livestock. Kijk nou net, kijk nou net hierdie klas plankie wat die mens nou trotseer om by die supermarkt uit te kom. Genade, as ek in die water val. Soos jylle kan sien, kan die mens enige ding onder die son in hierdie supermarkt poot kry. Alles wat jou hart begeer. In die boonste rak kan jy huisraad sien. Tot die horloosie wat jy kan koop as jy sal wil. 
Um, aan die kant het jy jou geblikte producten. Aan hierdie kant het jy jou <laughs> imp- impuls in kopies. So, jy kan sien die kinders is redelijk rondom, <laughs> rondom die lekker goed. Hierdie is die skoonheids producten. So, shampoos en jou um, uh, roompies en jou gel en jou dinge. Hier is die harde waarde. <laughs> So as jy iets nodig het um, om jou huis te repareer of iets te doen, dan is hierdie jou rak. <laughs> verf, as jy jou huis wil oorverf. Mens kan selfs op rekening koop hier, allemaal ken mekaar hier. So as jy nie die dag geld het nie, dan kan jy net sê ek betaal jou morgen en, en allemaal vertrouw mekaar. Dis nie, soos in die oude in Zuid-Afrika. So this is a bamboo, a hollowed out bamboo. And um, they put food in here and they put it over a fire like a barbecue and uh, it's called panso like chicken panso or rice panso and they fill it with um, rice and coconut milk for example uh, or chicken and herbs and you let it um, kind of rest on something over at an angle over some some um, charcoal and it cooks the chicken and the rice cooks inside this you turn it over and you don't want need to wash dishes. Amazing. And it tastes really amazing as well. Do not wrestle over it with the wrong time. <laughs> Just let go it is not worth your life. And when the wrong time are moving, later on you will see that we always move up in the trees. Very few will move on the ground. Like I said, it's not always exactly at nine when you come in and you will see the wrong touch. So we are at Sumango Wildlife Center. Um, it's roughly nine o'clock in the morning and we are going to watch the orangutans being fed this morning. So if you can see behind me uh, in the tree, there is, there is one. Uh, he's already having some breakfast this morning. So um, we're hoping that we'll see some more. Despite extreme logging and deforestation, Borneo remains one of the most wonderfully biodiverse places in the world. The little natural rainforest that remains is spectacular. For three years Miguel and I called Sarawak home, and it is here that we got the idea to do South Africans abroad. Along the way we met some more South Africans. Next time we visit the industrious Duplessis family in Cebu for some bultong, an African craft.